Hey guys, that my game and back here for that video. Guys, today we're going to be talking about how to snipe for training in MUT 22. We'll be looking at all the basic principles, which cards you should target, and which cards will make you the most coins in MUT 22. Let's go ahead and get right into it. All right, so once we go ahead and go to the auction house, we can actually go ahead and start sniping these cards for training. Now, starting off right away, it's a little bit different than we do for actually sniping with regular cards because with training, we're not really focused focus too much on the this card that card and which card is going for more which card is going for less we're actually more focused on overall ranges so we're sorting cards based on overalls rather than based on price so starting off right away here is a general guideline of what we can actually look for when sniping for training starting off right away if we do see an 83 overall we like to see it at a price tag of 17,000 coins for 87 overalls we want to get them at a price tag of 77,700 coins for 89 overall we want to get them at a price tag of 164,000 coins. 84 overalls around 26,000 coins. 85 overalls for 39,100 coins. 82 overalls for 12,700 coins. 86 overalls 58,300 coins. I will have the thing on the screen right now, guys. Uh, but let's go ahead now and break down each of these uh, overalls, what we're targeting, and why we're targeting that. So first off, starting off right away with the 83 overalls. The reason why we want to get these cards at these certain target prices it's because these target prices will go ahead and give us the best coin to training ratio that is what we're looking for when it comes to you know um when it comes to go ahead and uh, snipe for training because that's going to give us the ability to actually get the most out of our coins so starting off right away we do have an 87 overall filter on the board and we're going to go ahead and now take a look at the cheapest 87 overall we can find so we do see that johnny unites does look at the cheapest 87 overall currently available so let's go ahead and take a look at a more uh, snipe down filter when go to quarterback we're also going to go ahead and go to 87 overall and you guys can see that he is actually 77,000 coins that's exactly what we want to see him at uh, almost identical actually this says 77.7 thousand so we're gonna go ahead and buy him right now and this is actually the identical card you want to buy when it comes to the 87 overalls you want to get him for that 77,100 or 700 uh, coin range or less so at this coin range this is going to give us 1500 training now because of this we bought him at 77,000 we're actually getting 51.8 80 coins per training which is the second best you can actually get so that's actually kind of cool that our first time doing this we actually got exactly what we wanted and more absolutely awesome now this applies like i said before this applies to any overall i listed you can do this exact same concept and to sort by overalls all you're going to go ahead and do is go to quantity and then choose whatever overall you want to start with so you might want to go ahead and start with 83 overalls and what i recommend doing is going ahead and because as you guys can see the whole entire market right now is flooded and the only way to fix this and actually see the newest card up because if we go ahead and sort this by newest you're going to see that no this is not the newest card up the 17 minutes ago this card or this card is 17 minutes left meaning that this card was posted 43 minutes ago so to see the newest card up all you're going to go ahead and do is go over to your filter system even more or where you uh you have type go ahead and sort that by single positions so you guys can see now we have sort this by quarterbacks and if we go ahead and scroll all the way down here you will see that this whole entire thing is flooded and if we look at of course the newest one up it's going to go ahead and say the 59 minutes so what this means at the is that there is a complete like there are a hundred cards of this or probably less than a hundred cards of this posted but it is showing us the newest card possible. So if we go through any single position, you can see less and less cards actually posted. So for example, this is going to go ahead and be less than 100 cards. So we are going to go ahead and see the newest card up right here. So like I said before, when it comes to this overall range of, of course, um, 83 overalls, we are looking at a price tag of around 17,000 coins. Sorry, guys, got to readjust my camera. Uh, there we go. 
All right, awesome. And so we're looking for a price drag range of around 17,000 coins. So if we can get 83s for 17k, uh, we are pretty much happy. So what I like to do is go ahead and just take a look at what cards might be at an 83 overall. And as you do this more and more, you will get a better generalized look of what cards are actually going for and what cards are actually at that price tag. So starting off with the overall range. So starting off with where we have LT, obviously not the uh, overall, not the price tag we want. So we move on to the the next card now looking at this it does also look like the only 83 overall running back we have is going to go ahead and be lt right here there's actually only one edition is 83 we also have a basically of packers running back aaron jones let's go ahead and take a look at what he's looking like around 20,000 coins definitely not what we're looking for so we move on uh, to the next card now the good thing right now is there's not too many cards on the market in all honesty so you can go ahead and actually have a lot better time at avoiding you know the mass cards on the market and not being able to see the newest card up or just not being able to see the in 83 overall up because there's only so many cards that does get posted right now which is absolutely awesome when it comes to sniping training later in the year it will be a little bit more difficult sniping training but again that will be based on the fact of how many cards are posted on the auction house now going down here as we go down the list here we can see that there are some receivers like b marshall right now who is going to go ahead and go for uh, 83 overall and we're going to see that he is actually at that price tag of exactly 19,100 coins just posted just for us and actually we want to see him at 17,000. so again just a tad bit too expensive now i am doing this currently at 3 19 a.m so if you do this during the daytime you're going to have a lot better luck than i am obviously if you guys do not know i record most of my videos at like three o'clock in the morning so that's why sometimes when it comes to sniping i just simply might not get the best snipes as of my first thing in this video is me getting a good snipe so i guess maybe i'm tad bit lucky right nonetheless though going by each single position though will really limit it down and it kind of shows you and gives you an idea of which cards are going to go ahead and be the cards we're going to target uh as we are sniping and like i said you can go through each single position uh as we have all these overalls i listed in the beginning of this video that we are looking for target range so it's not just certain cards it's all overalls we are looking for now the cards i would recommend going ahead and just staying away from overall wise it's going to go ahead and be 90 overalls there's simply not enough 90 overalls in the game right now to really go ahead and break down which of those cards is the best to target or that kind of stuff we do have 90 overalls on our chart here but they're not really posted too much it's 313,000 coins uh which is actually right exactly dab right where we want it right there so that b marsh is a thousand coins over what we want 1500 coins over what we want but you could even target that b marsh and actually be happy going ahead and getting him uh but like i said you're pretty much going to be targeting a lot less of cards when it comes to overalls you'll be targeting cards like you know 312 310 that's why i said again you can go ahead and go for these 90 overall cards i just don't personally recommend it and if you want to even you could go ahead and go over to uh the sets and actually complete b marsh sets and might be able to get them done for cheaper and if you get them for cheaper you can even save some coins there uh but even b marsh at three uh 13 000 coins gonna go ahead and be 62.60 training it's just not really worth it when you can literally get a card right now for 12 coins less per training uh so it's just simply not really worth it uh nonetheless though if you guys did enjoy this video though make sure you hit the like and subscribe button down below guys try on a whole new setup try on that new editing style if you guys do enjoy the new editing style i do appreciate that subscribe button down below guys i'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers on this channel so if we can hit that i do appreciate it thank you guys for watching i'll see you